So with school starting this week, you're going to need a way to communicate with families. And in this video, I'm going to show you an easy way to create a classroom newsletter using Canva. But before I do that, feel free to subscribe to my YouTube channel where each week I'll be uploading new videos on a variety of different topics. So thanks for your consideration, and now let's talk newsletters. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can use Canva to create your own classroom newsletter. This is going to be quick, it's going to be easy, and best of all, your newsletters are going to work awesome. The first thing you have to do is to create a Canva for Education account, either through your district or by signing up at canva.com education. Once you're signed in, go ahead to the main page of Canva and select Create Design. You'll want to search for School Newsletter. Next on the left, go ahead and choose a template. Once you find a template that you like, one of the great things about Canva is that you can completely customize everything that you see. Starting with text, titles, even colors and images. If you'd like to add photos or graphics, go ahead and click Elements and search. If you want to upload your own photos, you can select the Upload button and drag any images that you might like. Once you're done with your newsletter, you have a couple different ways to share it. If you select the share button, download, and you can choose either a PDF print if you'd like to print that out as a paper newsletter, or you can share it as a view only link. When you share this link with parents, they'll be able to view it like a website, but they won't be able to edit anything on there. If you'd like to keep this same format, you can very easily duplicate your newsletter and just change individual parts of it. Or you can always add a page, go back to templates, and choose a new design. So that's the quick and easy way for you to create a beautiful newsletter to communicate with parents and families using Canva. I hope this video was helpful. If you have any questions, go ahead and leave them in the area below. Thanks for watching and have a great school year.